Ovulation is the release of a matured egg from the ovary and it takes place once every month depending on the woman's menstrual cycle. Normally, ovulation occurs 14 days before the next menstrual period. My channel. I am Nurse Smith. In this channel, I talk about women's health, especially fertility, pregnancy, labor, delivery, family planning, parenting, and lots more. So, if you're visiting my channel for the first time, please click on the red subscribe button below this video and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss out anytime I upload a great video in this channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to calculate your ovulation day of 22 days menstrual cycle, 24 days, 26 days. 28 days, 30 days, and 32 days menstrual cycle. So stay tuned. Normally, ovulation takes place 14 days before the next menstrual period. And that's why to calculate your ovulation day, you will subtract 14 from your menstrual cycle. As usual, this is my calendar. This is, let's assume it's November 2021 calendar. And you have 22 days menstrual cycle. Let's say you started seeing your period on the one and you have 22 days menstrual cycle if your if your menstrual cycle is 22 days subtracting 14 from your menstrual cycle gives you eight that means if you have 22 days menstrual cycle your ovulation takes place on the eight now if you have 24 days menstrual cycle subtracting 14 24 subtracting 14 from it gives you 10. So if you have 24 days menstrual cycle, your ovulation takes place on day 10. If you have 26 days menstrual cycle, subtracting 14 out also, 26 minus 14, it gives you 12. That means on the 12th, a lady with 26 menstrual cycle sees her ovulation. If she has 28 days menstrual cycle, her ovulation will take place on day 14. But you don't divide into two and say because you have 28 days menstrual cycle divided into two means your ovulation will be on day 14. No, you have to use this formula because ovulation takes place 14 days before the next menstrual period, before the first day you receive blood. So subtracting 14 from your from your menstrual cycle gives you your ovulation. If your ovulation is if you have menstrual cycle of 27 days, also subtract 14 from it and get your ovulation day. So if you have 30 days menstrual cycle, when you subtract 14 from 30, you find that you have your ovulation on day 16. That means day 16 will be your ovulation for a lady with 30 days menstrual cycle, as the case may be. If you have 32 days menstrual cycle, subtract 14 from it and get 18. So your ovulation is on day 18. Also know that your first day of menstruation can be any day in the month. Not necessarily the first day of the month. So it can be any day within this month. So your first day of menstruation is your day one of your menstrual cycle. Start counting from there. Now, there are facts to know about ovulation. One, sperm remains viable up to five days in a woman's body. Two, the ovulated egg must be fertilized within 12 to 24 hours after it is released. So, few days before you ovulate, are your most fertile period to get pregnant especially if you're trying to get pregnant but if the egg is not fertilized it is expelled from the uterus accompanied by menstrual period so if you're trying to get pregnant you need to have unprotected intercourse before you ovulate or within 24 hours after ovulation you need to have unprotected intercourse few days before the ovulation or on the ovulation day not after the ovulation but if you don't want to get pregnant there is a link in the description box on how to calculate your sex period to avoid pregnancy in my next video i'll be discussing the signs of ovulation so subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss out when i upload the video